before that, let us review our lesson about friction and gravity. Are you ready? Answer the blockbuster. What F is push or pull? Force. What F opposes the movement of an object? Friction. You're right. What S is a factor that could affect friction? Surface. What RF is a type of friction that uses roller or wheels? Rolling friction. What G is a downward force that pulls object towards the center of the earth? Great! Gravity! What D is a factor that can affect the gravitational force? Distance What M is a heavenly body with only 16% of the Earth's gravitational force? The answer is Moon Wow! Good job kids! You are now ready to learn about energy. Our objectives are Define what is energy Identify the different forms of energy And cite examples of the different forms of energy What is energy? Energy is the ability of an object to do work. We use energy in every task we do. Without energy, we cannot perform well. What are the two types of energy? Potential energy is energy due to the position of an object. When object is at rest, it has potential energy. Here are objects possessing potential energy. A book resting on a table, a rock hanging on a cliff, and a car parked in a parking lot. Kinetic energy. Moving objects possess kinetic energy. It is an energy in motion. Here are examples of objects with kinetic energy, a moving train and roller coaster, and children playing basketball. But how do potential and kinetic energy work? Let's find out. Remember that potential and kinetic energy is always constant at 100%. Let's try to analyze the given situation. If the cyclist is at resting position, it has 100% potential energy and zero kinetic energy. But as the cyclist pedals his bicycle, it gradually loses its potential energy and turns into kinetic energy. Try to remember that the total amount of potential and kinetic energy is constant at 100%. Now it's your turn. How much energy does the girl have at point A and point B? Let's try a simple activity. Identify the following picture if it demonstrates potential or kinetic energy. Number 1. A spacecraft about to launch in space. Number 2. 
Number two, a cyclist joining a bicycle competition. Number three, a car in a parking lot. A girl jumping in a trampoline. A lady sitting on a chair. Let us check your answer. For picture number one, the answer is kinetic energy. Picture number two has kinetic energy. Picture number three has potential energy. And number four has kinetic energy. And last, and picture number five has potential energy. Good job, kids. I'll see you again next week. Goodbye.